Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Cam here from the Tech Lecture. Today we're going to be taking a look at setting your host name in Fedora using the terminal. So first thing we got our Fedora virtual box here. Now let's go ahead and go up here and click on activities. Type in term and click our terminal. Alright, so now that we got that opened up, as you can see our host name here is localhost. You can also type in the host name command that will give you your host name. Um, so what we're going to do here is we're going to use the hostname ctl command. So hostname ctl set dash hostname, and then uh, let's call this we'll call this lab lab03. So we run that, and then uh, if we close our terminal here, we can open it back up. And there we go. So as you can see, our host name is now Lab003. Uh, you can also run host name again. If I can spell host name again, and we have Lab003. Uh, I think. Can, let's see. Host name is another one we could do. And then, uh, so as you can see, our host name is Lab003 now. All right. So there's a there's a lot of stuff you can do with this. Uh, or not a lot of stuff, but a few things that you can do with our the uh, hostname ctl command here. Now this is going to be on systemd machines. Um, if you have an older version of Fedora, like a really really old version, or uh, or if you're on a different operating system, if you're on anything, I think you went to 14.04 and prior, um, it's not going to have this hostname ctl command. Um, if you do not have that, then you can. You can do this. Uh, you should be able to do echo whatever your host name is, and uh, so whatever you want your host name to be, and you can echo that into Etsy hostname if you're on one of those operating systems. Otherwise, um, go ahead and use the hostname ctl command because that's that's the new way to do it. Um, so this is running on Fedora 25. This is Fedora 25 workstation, and this is running on a machine in VirtualBox, but uh, it doesn't matter even if you're on physical hardware. Um, this is still going to be the exact same. So, all right, guys, thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any recommendations for future videos, please let me know. Um, if you have any comments or questions concerning this video or any other videos, um, go ahead and leave those in the comment section below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Have a good one.